Hey guys, it's James here with another Minecraft episode of Titan MC. I'm here with Desri the Pro. Hi. Yeah. So so far we're in the hub. So you got wait, you got prison one. So that's one part of the hub, and all the ranks in here are all reset as you go inside. So we're in prison four. So if you want to follow me in. Alright, now that we're in, I'll read the quick quick rules. Alright, so game rules. The guard the guard's word is final, don't attempt to kill any guard, don't get caught holding a sword, no group um group killing guards, failure to do so will result in death or jail or death. Listen to the guards. No hacking, no advertising, respect all players and staff, and you will get banned. Alright. Sure. So let's All right. go through. Alright. So the first thing I'll show you is how you basically rank up. So in every spot you have to come to the warden. So you just right click and then if you go over here it will show you all the ranks. But at a certain rank, so on the side here, right here where it says so currently I'm ranked C four. To rank up I need three hundred and sixty thousand dollars. And I got 1,587 tickets, and I have $288. So I'll quickly show you. So every time you get tickets, you come over here. So you got C1 shop temporarily access to C1 shop costs 100 tickets, and then you got the C2 shop, which costs 250 tickets, and then the C3 shop is 500 tickets. So basically this shop is more expensive than the shop I'm going to show you now. It, I think it's about six times more expensive. Alright, so here's just a simple shop. So you got all the food, then you got all the ores and ingots, and then you got wooded planks, you got some ores, you got a few tools. So over here, you got an enchantment area so every level so I got 22 levels so I'll buy this one here so you just click on that it costs one ticket and then yeah you can level your stuff up so if you come over here I'll just show you so over here he's doing a deal so for $1500 you bring in one leather helmet one leather chest plate one leather leggings and one leather boots so if you come over here, you would need a sword. I'll just show you. So you just kill these cows. I'll just quickly kill the cow here. Alright. I think I have enough already. Alright. Alright, so I did kind of have a few on me already. Alright, so all you have to do now is come over here and just make all the leather stuff that you usually use, but I've already done the ticket. So all you do, come over to him with all of it in your inventory, and then just push confirm, and then you'll get whatever, you, the reward of $1,500. Alright, so moving on. This way. This way. No, the other way is fine. Alright, so over here... It basically shows you how to set up a sign with your if you want to buy a sell. So it's just telling you how to set up all the buy and all that stuff. So yeah, I'll just move across slowly. And if you come down here, you can come rent. It's, it's uh, just an auction house. So you just come down here. When they're auctioning places, and yeah, you just run off for an auction but I'm guessing it doesn't really get used a lot. So the current cell I'm in is E Ward. So you got your log mine this way. I'll just quickly show you. <laughs> so yeah, if you come over here, you pull out your iron axe, and then you just come down, I think it's this spot, and then you just start heading it. <coughs> hitting all the logs. 
So I'll just grab a few. Alright, so I just grabbed a few. Then if you come to this guy, same thing. He's doing bring me one iron axe for a thousand dollars, which is quite a bit. So yeah, that's his task to do. And all of it's different. Hey, why are you? I don't see. Yeah. Alright. Okay. I think there's something over here. So you got all the cells up here. So if you come over here, I'll just show you an example. If he's got a name anywhere here. No, oh, he's got no name. Wait. Oh, whoops, wrong side. Alright, so his is bro 1016. So down here is showing him how much money he's got. And then here's the rates. So if you just look here, here's what he's done, so he's selling one emerald block for 3100 and then one emerald, no sorry, one diamond block for 3100 then an emerald block for 8000 8, and then an iron block for 100 and he's got some of his weapons and stuff around here alright, now I'll just show you the mine spot oh. Oh, should give you the heat. Oh, never mind. Oh, sorry, I just dropped my bow. Alright, now, so here's the sign. So every ward will have like a little sign. So you follow the sign down, then I'll take you. So now I'm just showing you the ore mine. Gotta eat some food. So here's a big mine sign. So, like again, you got all the cells around, and each cell doesn't usually sell for the same price. So yeah, you just come down these steps. And then usually they'll have like a little sign spot where you can sell stuff. That's usually quite well known. So yeah, just come along here, get some coal, get a bit of iron. Yeah, there's an iron. Hey, there's an iron here. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. Alright, I'm not really too familiar with this mine, but... I think there might be a shop around here somewhere. Um, no. On the other side. Oh. Um, it's a guy. Oh, maybe a guy. Oh. Thanks, helper. <laughs> hey, don't call me helper. <laughs> um, you also have a... Uh, there's also... Oh gosh. You see. Yeah, so you got a place to sell. And I th if I'm not mistaken, there actually might be a task I oh yeah, he's Yes. Here. Black yeah. lung. Black lung. So here, bring me one iron pickaxe for a thousand bucks. And I think if I I'm got not one mistaken, efficiency one. Yeah. And it it's gonna be efficiency one. Alright. So after you've done that run up the stairs. Uh, I do a thief? Or what? <laughs> um, here you have the furnace rooms. Yeah, yeah, so you got all the furnace rooms, which I'm going to show you now. So with these pressure plates, as you step on that, the door will close. And as you move more forward, it will close. So okay. I'll just smell a few coal. Few iron ore, so I'll just smell one iron ore to just show you guys. <coughs> right, so now after you've done that, 
See, if I move forward, now the door unlock, and then I can go outside. I'm lagging. Yeah. Oh. So here's a food, the food farm, which is kind of where I showed you guys again. Yeah. So here's the other side of the farm. So yeah, just bring a sword, come over here, just kill all the pigs and the cows for meat, and go back to the smeltery and yeah, just cook up all your meat. It's pretty simple. I'm lagging out like crazy. So we do D mine now. So yeah, I'll just quickly show you guys D mine. So I'll just go back to spawn and then just show you guys the same spot. So yeah, to the right we got D mine. Um. Yeah. Right. So yeah, it's basically the same thing, but all the prices um. would have gone up. And the uh, the only way that'd be fishing it, rod. Yeah. So the only way to get in here is you have to go through all the levels from E in order to get in here. Yeah. Because if you try going inside, it'll push you out. So if you come along here, since I already got a fishing rod, come along this way. You forgot about the mine. Yeah, so you just come all the way down here. Kind of taking a bit of time to get down. So over here you got the little fishing spot. And you will also have a wood mine there. So same thing. Six raw fishes for the type price of $7,500. So I've already got a bit. So I might as well show you guys. So there you go. And yeah, I've lost 30 tickets from doing that since I've already done it. So you just come here, stand still. Oh. And yeah, just wait around. You might meet a few people standing here. And you do have a chance of getting like a string. So if it does like that, you usually have a chance of getting a string, which usually shall sells for around one million to two million. Two so million to. Yeah. Um. But yeah, like same thing. You got higher price sales in here. So you got some guys that might close their doors while they're full sold, or maybe then so. You would pay twelve thousand dollars, and you would get to have the cell, and then you can start buying your own stuff in there, or putting your own stuff in. So you got quite a few more down here, and this is the oh no, it's not the bottom. Yeah, here's the bottom here, at least. So, but and there's one more level. D block isn't really that good to come and get from. It's usually around C. And B and A are usually the good ones to try and get into. Alright, so coming back this way. I'll just run all the way back. Alright, so now I'll just show you guys the mine. It's basically the same deal. So at the start again, you got sell cobble, so you just right click and it'll sell. You don't have to keep clicking, you can just hold down your mouse button. So now I've gained a bit more money. And then down here again, got the more furnaces. So you just run down the stairs. So here you got all the same deal. Just step inside, go smelting, and then come back upstairs. Kind of got stuck there. <laughs> so, 
after you've got enough iron and sticks same thing come over to this guy he's got the same task to do a different task mm. so you bring him bring him 32 rails for five thousand dollars <coughs> uh, yeah just a Sorry decoration over here of different stuff so yeah there's the other mine and you can go up to the top over there if you wanted to right yeah so here's a just a basketball court I'm guessing someone built as a decoration wait for me uh, I will show yeah, so there's an auction house again <laughs> so every cell will have an auction house and then every cell will also have the enchants but I think it might be better in this world no wait no it's the same one so yeah if I come over here these prices should have changed or gone up a little bit but yeah guys thanks for watching peace out